618 here on Channel 5 News this morning. They came with one thing in mind, to raise money in the fight against childhood cancer. As Rick Diaz shows us in this morning's Call Me Hente, some even volunteered to shave their heads. This is the third year they've held the St. Balric's head shaving event in FAR. What this is all about is trying to find a cure and better treatments for childhood cancer. A person pledges to shave their heads, their friends and relatives then donate on their behalf. There's over 30 parents, volunteers, and different members of the fire department here. I'm doing this in memory of my dad. My dad passed away six years ago from bladder cancer. I've been fortunate enough not to know anybody with cancer, but I'm happy to support anybody who does. This week, I just received good news that I'll be able to possibly go into what they call a maintenance treatment, which means I only will have to take treatments twice a year. Even those that will be cutting the hair are volunteers. They believe in the kids. Kids, there's also the father and son team. Everybody all right? Our own Oscar Adame was the master of ceremonies. <laughs> but there are two other major stories here involving mothers and daughters. She's pretty brave. She shaved her hair. She's doing it because I'm almost going to finish and she's going to shave it. Angelica writes, she's up here. There is something special going on here, something the rest of us can only marvel, a bond only a mother and daughter can explain. And today, they are both looking at the face of cancer, proclaiming that today that bond has grown even stronger. For Channel 5 News, I'm Rick Thies.